Hey everyone, Ross Levitan here with the Locked On Senators podcast alongside Brandon Piller and the Sens have shocked the hockey world, selecting Tyler Boucher at 10th overall. Pilsy, we had him 55 on our draft rankings. Definitely shocked a lot of people, us included, but let's start with the player right away, Ross. This is a guy that plays with a lot of physicality. He's going to finish all his checks and he's not just going to nudge a guy, he's going to run through them. He's my type of player, and you think Brady Kachuk sitting at home loves this pick, and not only because they're similar styles of players. If you listen to Locked On Senators, our draft rankings, I called him a poor man's Brady Kachuk. He's hard to move in front of the net. He opens himself up for passing lanes, always is an option there, and he's going to start every single scrum. There's a shift we posted at Sen Central where he knocks down three guys, and later in the game, he gets kicked out for another eh, maybe questionable hit, but Pilsy this guy he models his game after Tom Wilson and it shows yeah I mean the physicality is there but he's not he's not just running around hitting guys this guy can score as well you can't cheat on him defensively because not only does he have a good shot he's a good passer too so he can include his teammates I would love to see this guy on a second power play unit as that net front presence guy because like you said, Brady Kachuk, he's going to be banging in rebounds all day. One thing, and you could say this with a lot of players this year, you wish you've seen more of him. Now this, it wasn't a case of COVID. It was a case of knee surgery. He got hurt, played 12 games, had 11 points though, and 22 penalty minutes. This guy, he fits in the core of what Ottawa's trying to do with Ridley Gregg, Alex Formanton. We mentioned the leader of all this, Brady Kachuk. And just like Brady Kachuk, Tyler Boucher is heading to Boston University next year unless, unless he goes to his CHL team where the Ottawa 67s hold his rights, Pilsy. Yeah, I mean, it's a possibility. We'll see. I, I think he'll end up going to Boston University, but it's a good storyline, that's for sure. A surprise, no doubt. We'll have a full breakdown of this on Locked On Senators. We're recording right after the first round, so stay tuned. Episode should be out by midnight.